Alright, hey guys, what's up? This is Kulo here. So, we're back here at the Omens Unlimited Cup, the stage one in progress. Um, we only have one day in time remaining, but we're gonna get it right here. So, I'm at two wins right now with this deck right here. Uh, we're gonna go resume. Okay, it's a pretty dirty deck, I gotta say. It's pretty dirty, okay? It's a forest craft, obviously. But, here we go. So, it's a guaranteed BNB deck. So I refined this deck pretty good, and um, the only Forest Craft card I have are pretty much the Whispering Woods and the Beauty and the Beast. So it's a guaranteed pull with the Whispering Woods. So I'm going to be using this deck, and I haven't been I haven't been seeing any other opponents using this deck. And I think this deck is really really dirty. Oh my god, it's so dirty. It's so good and dirty. <laughs> So we're going to be using this deck right here, but before that, we're having so many, so many, like, um, uh, Grand Prix Cups right now. I wonder why, like, it, I, I love the event, like, it's it's a really fun uh, event for sure, but I feel like if they put in, like, some, like, themes or something, like, I don't know, you, you can maybe limit it to, like, three legendaries or something, or all card cost should be lower, but lower than five or something you know like some um, theme would be really fun in my opinion but this is okay as well I guess we're having this like pretty frequently though like every other week maybe and where did that treasure trove event go that that event is the best it's a private match event where you could like um, have matches against any other um, random friends that you have or some strangers and after you have a game, you have a chance to like win money or some like packs or like it's just pretty much like a lottery ticket that you get. And that that thing is really fun. You get and I think like ten chances or something within the ten days or something, right? It's so fun. I haven't heard anyone win that <coughs> win that uh one million what was it? One million gold or something yet, yeah, but like I wanna I wanna hear it in the uh the reddit community that one that would be pretty amazing all right so we're gonna be going here we're at the two wins right now so pretty sure we can win here let's go all right so we're queued up for our first match in this video but it's our third match in the grand prix and we're gonna be facing against runecraft daria okay so um, unless it's like a high roll daria deck i think we should be fine Okay, Elf Twins Assault. It might be a, what is it, a Mysteria deck as well. They, they've been popping up a lot lately too. Elf Twins Assault. I'm going second. Lyriel. Uh, Lyriel's pretty good for sure. Don't really need to air yet, I think. Elf Twins Assault. Should I keep it? He's going first. Yeah, I'm gonna keep it. And the Whispering Woods. Nice. So that's a guaranteed BNB in our hand now. That's pretty awesome. I usually like putting it out on turn 4, but if we have a BNB in our hand, then I'll probably put it put out the Whis Whispering Woods on turn 2. Okay, let's greet this person. And most likely, I don't know, just like a Lirio on turn 2. A solid Lirio. Nice, impartial sticks is so strong. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure I could put out the B and B by turn six. I'll put out Whispering Woods. Maybe. Whoa! It's not really doing anything. Interesting. Interesting. I think I'm gonna put out the Moon and Sun. And put out the Tsukuyomi. And I'll put out Impartial Strix on turn four, and then I'll put out Whispering Woods. Whispering Woods on turn 5. So on turn 6, we'll get that guaranteed B and B. Whoa. It was definitely aiming for that. Okay, let's put the impartial sticks. And I feel like we could um we could definitely Evo here. He won't be able to kill it, I don't think. He only used what? One spell or two spells? Like one spell, I think. So we should be fine. Yeah. 
He's gonna Evo that. Okay. Yeah, he had to. Okay. So far, it's going pretty good. We're gonna go 7 to the face for sure. And then Whispering Woods. And then we'll put the Goblin out. Wait, one, two, three. Yeah, we'll put the Goblin out as well. And we'll still have six cards in our hand, plus another hand, another uh, draw from later. So this is solid. Okay, I think we got this one. Because we also have the area soothing Harpist as well in our hand. So six, seven is guaranteed. And Freshman Low. And Windblast. Okay. <laughs> okay, I think we got this here. I think we got this here. Okay, it sees the beauty and the beast. I'm gonna go for the board clear here. Because next turn I have the kill, anyways. Okay, so. Let's do that. Let's do this. <laughs> And we get another B and B in our hand. Like, look at that! Oh my God, this this whispering woods is too OP. With like some like you know I don't know some custom decks I guess. Really good card. Really good card. Ooh, he could kill it. Interesting. What about the next one though? Okay, I'm totally fine with that because I got another BNB. And we'll evil that as well. Man, this deck is dirty. Whew. And another BNB in our hand. <laughs> oh man, I know. I know. It's dirty, but unlimited. Everyone has to play dirty, guys. Everyone. So. It's fair. <laughs> I'll obviously be playing memes as well, but I really like BNB. I really like BNB. I know it's a really, really broken card for sure. People hate it, definitely. I like it. <laughs> I like it. Okay, is he gonna. Oh, I killed that goblin R8. Okay, let's see. How... Can I kill him here? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I got five neutrals, so Elf Twins Assault will be really good. Okay, let's just use the Elf Twins Assault. Okay, and then we'll go nine to the face. And then we'll Erd the BNB, so we'll get a free BNB. And Lirio. Don't think he could beat that. I don't think so. Even if he has like a ward, I guess, right? We got Ariat Soothing Harpist to uh, reset the damage or reset his attack, so. Yeah, I think we got him, guys. Yeah, this, this deck, guys. This deck. <laughs> it's pretty good. Okay. Does he have like a D shift? If, if he has D shift, I might lose. He can't. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I admit, I admit it. This this deck is super dirty. <laughs> okay. But I don't see anyone using it yet. So it might be one of the first ones, maybe. But match four. Here we go. It's the decisive one. If we get this one, we go into group A. Alright, we're queued up for our fourth match. It's gonna be against. Who is it? Oh snap. Oh snap. Urius. There he is. There he is. The highest roller of all games right now. Okay, so we're going we're gonna be going first. Whispering Woods, Whispering Woods. No, I don't really think I need two of them. Let's recycle one of them. Let's see what we get. Twin Elf's Assault. Pretty solid. Pretty solid. Okay. Okay, so I guess I kind of lied. Um, I have Elf Twins Assault as well in my um 
in my forest craft deck. I did say I only have Whispering Woods and BNB, &B, but sorry. I do have some spells in, in this uh, deck as well. Huh? The only forest craft minion I have is BNB. &B. There we go. Okay, so let's put the goblin out and greet this person. Okay, goblin fighter is super solid in this deck as well. It gives you a 2 1 and also replenishes, uh, replenishes you with a card as well, so really good with BNB. A blood fed flower bed. Oh snap. Okay, expect the goblin fighter out. Get another goblin, alright. I think we could do this. Okay, okay, mask of the black death. Alright. Let's see here. I think I'm gonna be putting out the Whispering Woods. Yeah, let's put the Whispering Woods out. I'll keep one Gobby, and I'll be at five cards, six cards. Yes. Okay, that'll be good. Wait a second. If I put this out, and then I'll be at four cards, five cards. Put Whispering Woods again. Actually, yeah, I think I'm gonna put out the goblin there. What's got Ambling Wrath? And another Ambling Wrath? Restless Parish? Okay, what a. Whoa, there he is. There's Floris. There is Floris here. Okay. So. I could still clear the board here. So I have one, two. One, two. Or you know what? I could Whispering Woods that. Yeah, let's just do that. Whispering Woods, the 5 3. And. We'll deal with the 1 1s. And then we'll go 2 for the face. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so we kind of need some more neutrals right now. Bira, okay. More neutrals would be really nice. Maybe I should have kept that goblin. One more neutral would be very solid. Very nice. Okay, let's put the pure hearted singer out. Sun and moon. Okay, so let's Evo this. And what am I at? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Um, let's see, let's see. I could I use Erd on that as well, but no. Okay, so let's deal with that. Right, and let's deal with that. Uh, okay, no, let's deal with that one one with the three 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 four. I mean, and we'll use the Elf Twins Assault. And I mean, can't really do anything else, but there. Okay, so next turn we'll put out the B and B. Okay, he's gonna go four to the face, I think, and I'll be at eight. Right? Ooh, Valnorin. Oh man. oh man. Does he have a DFB? If he does, we're, we're dead. But we gotta put out Hector and then. Okay, we gotta put the Hector, deal with that 4 3. Evo, good Hector. I mean, he can't have a DF. That's not a dark beast bad. I don't think so. I don't think so. No way, Jose. 
another Vira, okay. Right? It can't be. It can't be. It, that cannot be a DFB. It can't be. <laughs> Come on. It can't be. No way. No way. Obviously, it is DFB. <laughs> How is that even possible? Holy shit. He didn't even draw any cards. And... I, I guess he kept it. Holy. Fucking DFBs, man. Fucking DFBs. Okay. Okay. Let that salt out. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. It's just 3-1. Alright, last game, guys. Let's go. Alright, we're queued up for our last match. We gotta win this. We have to. Stormcraft Erica, Nice. Oh... But if it's aggro, it might be bad. I could deal with aggro's pretty good, I think, but... Um, hmm. Yeah, I think I should be fine. I'm going first as well. Uh, I guess I don't really need two Sylvan Justice. Actually, yeah, I'll keep it. Damn, DFB, man. DFB. Alright. Alright, let's just switch it up. Let's not think about that game anymore. It's okay. Okay, so it's a aggro swordcraft. I think we could I think we should be fine here. Maybe. Okay, so we'll put the I think we'll put out Lario. And then he's gonna put out another Stormfaller or something, right? So that's when we'll use the Elf Twins Assault and gain the gain the tempo. Oh, that's a one three. Nah, I can still deal with it. So he's gonna have another storm, so I'll Sylvan Justice that I guess. Oh man, this is it might be too late guys. <laughs> it might be too late. <laughs> he's got all the storms. This is not good. Hopefully we got the temple back now. At 15. What's he gonna put out? Another storm, obviously. Evo storm? Yep. <laughs> oh, how, how, how can I read you so easily? Man, uh, it's like I just like. It's like I knew you for years. Like I knew you were gonna do that. <laughs> oh, man. So predictable. Okay, so. What is that? Three? And I got one, two neutrals. Hmm. I guess we'll put out the pure hearted singer first. And a goblin? Okay. <sighs> What should I do here? One, two, three. One, two, three. I think... I think that's the best way. Hopefully he doesn't have the assemble, uh, what is it, the knight's assemble or something, and put out two more storms. But he's my long friend, so I kind of know what he's going to do. Okay, so he's put, he puts one storm out. Okay. Okay, we should be fine still. Please, please get me a neutral. One neutral. Mmm, not a neutral. Not a neutral. Okay. 
Okay, let's let's uh, face that 4-4. Four, four. Give me a neutral. Nice. Okay, neutral. Okay, so we'll use the Hectar on that 4-3. And then we'll put the Goblin out as well. Or we'll evil the Goblin. Yes! Oh man, we got him. We got him. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Nice, nice. Oh man, I don't think I've advanced in the in the commentary in a while, to be honest. But we finally got it, stage one, group A, with the B and B guaranteed deck here. Whew, Okay. So we lost against one of them. What was it? DFB, great. The Dark Beast bats. Oh, they were so strong. But this is the most refined deck that I have right now for NBA, B and B. So if you guys want to try try it out, please try it out and let me know. <laughs> Alright, so let's redeem the rewards. See what we get. 130 rupees and a pack. Okay, let's go open that pack for sure. Let's see, what do I need? What do I need? What do I need? Um What do I need here? I got all the shadow crafts. I wouldn't mind, uh... I wouldn't mind Lapis, the Haven Crafts. I do kind of want to try her. Pulse of Killing, okay. Ah... Uh, I really have to try this card as well. The Sinister Sarcophagus or something? Wait, the Sinister Sarcophagus. I gotta try this card out as well. I want to try it out for sure. Okay, so that is it for today, you know? So thank you so much for watching guys and hopefully you guys have a great great day. Peace out.